Hey, what's up, everyone? Thanks for joining us again. Today, I'm going to show you a place that my wife and I uh, always go to for uh, some quick breakfast. It is a uh, goi tu rua, which is Thai boat noodles. And now, these boat noodles they used to be served uh, all throughout the canals and around the rivers of Thailand. People stopped living uh, near canals and rivers, so now they're located mostly around like roadsides and. Uh, parts of uh, the city. So the first thing they add for Goi Tu Rua is uh, some Thai sweet basil. It smells really good. And some bean sprouts. And we top it off with some fried pork skin. And then you can also add some extra chilies. But I'm warning you, it is already spicy already. The broth that they have for this soup, really spicy already. But you can add just a little bit more. And I just like to add some, this uh, sort of like a pickled uh, chili vinegar sauce. So you can choose different styles of noodles for Guitura. Um This one I chose is Senyai, uh, which in Chinese uh, or Cantonese language is Hao Fan, uh, flat rice noodles. You can order it uh, with beef or you can order it with pork uh, but we usually order it with uh, beef except Alice. Alice loves a big bowl of uh, pork balls. She just eats pork balls and she can eat those all day long. And then you gotta really mix it up and then just dig in. Mm. That's good stuff. Now, if you look at this, this is a uh, Thai pandan coconut custard, kanam toy, uh, which I made before. Uh, I'll put a link in the description box below. I'm gonna save this for later because this will help fight off the heat uh, later on. Oh, today is extra spicy. Now, when you order these, there are two prices. There is a, a standard price, uh, which is tamada, regular price, which is about 15 to 18 baht, and then you have the and then you have the uh, special, which is this bowl. So the special is about 30 baht. It's basically two regulars dumped into one big bowl, so about the same price. It used to be about 10 baht for the regular bowl, uh, but you know, inflation and stuff, so. Yeah, so bowl noodles, they're normally eaten during uh, breakfast and lunch. Uh, so these shops open from morning time to around like, um, like late afternoon time, yeah? But you can't find this uh, served inside like maybe festivals or certain night markets. Now, you can easily recognize a Goi Tiu Rua shop. Uh, there is a boat um, outside of the shop and like I mentioned, uh, that's the way that used to be sold uh, on a boat, so... Okay, come on, come on. Yeah, so usually the portions are so small that uh, you would have to order like extra portions. And you can even mix the noodles. I'm gonna put some sen neck into my sen yai and just mix it up. And then I also like to add the soup from my last bowl right into my new bowl. <clears throat> so, so one thing I, I know that most people might be concerned about eating in a place like this is the, is the hygiene and the cleanliness. And I can tell you that I've been eating in these type of places for like, for a really long time and I've never really gotten sick once at all. But I have gotten sick eating at fancy uh, buffet restaurants like really sick. I mean to the point that I'm hugging my toilet, you know, and squirting from both ends. So I'm just speaking for myself. Um, yeah, I never get sick eating in these places. I guess because it's really busy here, so they have a quick turnaround. Okay, so after eating food that's really spicy, it's nice to have some ice cream. Uh, this is coconut ice cream with some, with some peanuts and some, um, what is that? That's a uh, pumpkin, yeah? and some young coconut. And uh, this whole uh, cup here cost uh, how much? 35 baht. Pretty cheap, huh? Uh, it's Alice's favorite. But for me, I'm gonna stick with the Kanam Toy. <coughs> Kanam Toy here is about 10 baht. It usually comes in like stacked up like that, so there's two pieces, so it's like five baht for one. I'm gonna dig in. And this will really, really help you relieve that spiciness from the boat noodles. Mm. 
All right, good. Definitely helped. So all the food we ordered cost about, uh, it's 170 baht, which is about, which is about $6. Um, I mean, it's not like, like really cheap, but it's Bangkok, so it's about normal price. And uh, it's pretty good food, so if you're ever in an area like this, and you're looking for some classic uh, Thai noodle soup food, uh, this would be a place that you want to go to. So that's joining us. Uh, come check it out next time, okay? Bye.